the world's oceans are at risk, and I think you know many people around the world have taken them for granted. They're 70 percent of, of the Earth's surface. But it starts with the fact that about 85 percent of the world's fish stocks are either seriously depleted or well on their way. You have over 400 dead zones where just life has stopped. It's an area about the size of New Zealand. Uh, you've got coral reefs, which are critical sub-ecosystems that feed the larger life in, in the overall oceans, and those have been at risk. So for us as a development institution, it's also a core issue because about a billion people in the world depend on fish as their primary source of protein. It's a key source of jobs, whether it be for tourism, whether it be fisheries, there's hundreds of millions of jobs depending on this. And so what we're trying to do is bring the different parties together and send a signal, the signal of SOS, Save Our Seas. The oceans are everybody's business, but no one can do it alone. And so you have a number of different uh, participants that some add know-how, some add financial resources, and there's actually hundreds of millions of dollars being uh, invested in the world's oceans. The World Bank, our programs uh, invest over a billion dollars uh, in oceans issues. But the challenge is how can we coordinate, cooperate more on this, try to set up some models of governance, whether it be for fisheries or, or pollution. Um, and that's where I think the World Bank can play a particular role because what we've seen in other areas of biodiversity, from tigers to other types of wildlife, is the bank is in a unique position. We've got relationships with developing countries, and they're often the core areas. We've got the developed countries as our supporters. Uh, scientific organizations, research organizations, and for the oceans, the private sector will be very important because a lot of companies are realizing they can put themselves out of business if they deplete the world's fisheries. So we see this as a, as a catalytic opportunity, and what we spent time doing over the past months is working with all these groups to try to focus on some key common goals, something to rally and coordinate the effort around.